Welcome to part 16, Destroying Enemies. Okay, so we need to edit the health script so that it knows the difference between players and enemies. So we'll add a new boolean, so public bool destroy on death. Alright, and now here, so when the health is less than or equal to zero, if destroy on death, that means it's an enemy game object, then destroy game object. And this will happen on the server, and since it's a networked game object, it will be automatically removed on the clients. Else, carry out this existing code, which will be for uh, the players. So we go back to Unity, go to our prefab, the enemy, and set destroy on death to true, and build and run. Okay, so let's bring in the host, bring in a client, so let's fire away, okay, let's shoot at the enemy, there you go, destroyed. Now if I shoot at the player, they will respawn, so their behavior is as upper before. So the script now knows the difference between an enemy and the player. Okay, in the next video we'll look a little bit more at player respawning and spawning in the first place.